This is the cutest fucking thing I've ever seen. <laughs> What's poppin' everyone? It's your girl Jay, and today I'm back with another mod overview. Today we're talking about the Home and Landco mod by Sim Realist. So I'm gonna show you features like laundry detergent, reusable towels, ironing, and lawn mowing. I just featured this mod in a top 10 realism mods that I use. I encourage you guys to check that out. But I wanted to dive deeper into this mod because I've been loving it lately. It really brings the laundry day pack to life and it should have been part of laundry day, but I'm at least grateful that we have a mod to pick up where EA lacks. You can find the mod linked in the post in the description box as well as any other information that you might need. So if that sounds good to you, then stay tuned. But before we get into the good stuff, feel free to show some love downstairs by liking the video for me and comment down below anything you want for your chance to be featured in our gang 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 shout out. Also subscribe if you already haven't to become part of the gang because we have a lot of fun on this channel if you can't already tell. All right, guys, now let's get into the Home and Land Co mod by Sim Realist. Buckle up for safety, mother. This is my Sim, Michaela, and she's gonna be helping us explore the mod today. So the first thing I wanna do is have her jump in the shower to show you this totally necessary towel set. I have two different stacks here, one here and one here, they both come with two towels. And if you read this description here, it says, this set of comfy towels will comfort your lonely night baths. Thinking about all those sentences you could have said to beat Becky in the argument. Two towels remaining. So you see these stacks both have two towels. When your sim showers, they use a towel. Therefore, it comes out of one of the stacks. And when you run out of towels, you have no choice but to do laundry to restore your towels. So this will all come full circle. They come out in their clothes first and then put the towel on so that's kind of whack but they still have to iron out all the kinks to the mod but it's such a good mod you'll deal with the glitches <laughs> so now when i hover over the stack you see now it says one towel remaining so like i said to replenish the towels you have to do laundry so before we do the laundry i have my washer upgraded to take laundry additives you have to upgrade your washer or you can even use the wash basin and instead of adding flour or food, you add this realistic laundry detergent. This is a rework of the Dabra laundry detergent. And one of these bad boys in your inventory counts as a laundry additive. So let's have our sim put that in her inventory. Come on, girl. Look at her. She's feeding her ferret. Comment below if you want a pet mod video next. Now that we have it in our inventory here, we can now click on the washer, go to add laundry additive, and add detergent. So we're gonna add some of the Dabra laundry detergent. Ta-da! <laughs> so one thing I discovered is that it's one-time use. I believe it's like $25, but once you use it, you have to replenish it and keep buying laundry detergent. So that's a little lame. I feel like it should have a few uses at least but hopefully we'll get that in an update. So now that we have the laundry additive in there, we can go ahead and do laundry. This is our laundry pile by Around the Sims 4. It comes with their slob life set. It's like a realistic laundry pile in the bathroom, so I love it. We'll click on it and we'll add this to the washing machine. So we're gonna have Michaela do the wash. Okay, so let's set these bad boys to dry. I've noticed it takes a couple times. I mean, it's kind of realistic, you know, you don't put enough time in your dryer, but hot damn. <laughs> <laughs> For the next part of the mod, we're gonna have to go over to the shed and bring out this bad boy. This mod adds realistic grass growing and lawn mowing to the game. So over time, your yard can get crazy. This is it pretty low, but these get big, trust me. So you have the option to take it out by hand manually. You can watch the grass grow if you're really, really bored. And you could also use the lawnmower, which we will in a second. But you see, she's taking it out like she was weeding something and it just zaps away. So now let's press use lawnmower and we'll do it in first person and watch her mow the lawn. It's really loud though, so headphone warning. I should have gave the warning before we started, but 
As you can see, she is clipping down all the bushes. The animations aren't perfect and the pathing isn't quite perfect. But from earlier versions, the mod has gotten pretty on point. So she'll keep going until pretty much the entire yard is mowed. Have you no fear? <laughs> Why are things not zapping? There we go. This reminds me of The Sims busting out for Game Boy and how there was that lawn mowing mini game. So I freaking love the lawn mower. But yeah, here's a little animation outside of first person of her going around mowing. You see the pathing could use some work, but it's still pretty cool. Where are you going, girl? She's going all the way <laughs> around the house to get to this little patch right here. But whatever, we're not mad at it. Do what you got to do to get the job done, boo. Let's go, girl. Oh my gosh, she's gonna walk all the way back around. We should put a gate back here. But I'm sure you get the gist. Let's check on our clothes. You see, it's still damp, so let's stop her from mowing the lawn for a second to put the clothes to dry again. Then I'm gonna have her finish mowing the lawn just because. So like I said before, I really like this mod because I love realism and I love chores and I'm weird. Like I purposely just dirty houses and like break objects just so that I can clean and <laughs> Yeah, I don't know if anybody else likes to play like that, but I love it. Okay, don't judge. <laughs> oh, she's all done. Yay. Let's see if the laundry is done. Oh, no, it's broken. We're just going to replace it because ain't nobody got time for that. Still damp. Jeez Louise. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> the laundry catches on fire. Of course it does. I put her to clean the lint tray also, and she just didn't. Extinguish yourself, please, Michaela. We have laundry to do. <laughs> Corey to the rescue. He got home right at the right minute. Oh, no. Don't tell me our laundry is ruined because it takes forever to do laundry in this damn game. Our laundry's still in there? Okay, good. It's in there just damp still. It didn't even catch on fire. That's how damp it was. You see, this is already stinking. <laughs> How does that happen? Let's just do more laundry, I guess. And you see how the slob life pile just turns into a single sock after? Okay, it's finally dry, but it says that it's used. Whatever. For the purpose of this video, we're going to show this anyway. I'm gonna have her go to iron the laundry. So she takes it out, and let's pause this really quick because I want Corey in the meanwhile to come add this to the dryer. Just so maybe I can show you from a different angle also. This is the ironing board. And so she walks over here and she actually irons the clothes. So let's see what that looks like. Ta-da! You see that? Isn't that the cutest thing you've ever seen? And then after the second piece, they start piling up. Don't you just love that? I love it. This is the cutest fucking thing I've ever seen. <laughs> oh no, it started to thunder. And then boom, she closes it back up. And the laundry is put away. And then they get like a buff for wearing ironed clothes. But this one says that clothes was used. I don't know why. Maybe because it caught on fire. <laughs> that could be it. I'm going to try one more time and we'll do it from first person this time then. Okay, it says it's dry the first time. That's rare. All right, now let's get the clothes and go to the ironing board. And then we take it off the wall. Like so. And then bam, we ironing, motherfucker. And there's also some tickle bitties there just for a nice view. And yeah, so that is the Home and Land Co. mod by Sim Realist. It gives you laundry detergent so you no longer have to put food and flowers in your freaking laundry it gives you grass growing realistic grass growing on your lawn and the ability to mow it down with a lawnmower 
It gives you a realistic towel set that Sims really use the towels from. And when you run out of towels, you have to do laundry. Because there's no real incentive to doing laundry, I feel. So this pushes you to want to do laundry. And then after you do it, you can iron it. Oh, they freaking dancing together. Why does he have scales? Aren't they so cute? Look at them. Aww. So anyways, that's going to be it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this overview of the Home and Land Co. mod. I know it took me a minute to figure out that you had to put the laundry detergent in your inventory. So I hope that little tip saved some people some trouble. But I just wanted to showcase this mod because it was featured in my top 10 realistic mods that I use in all my games pretty much. Like I use it in every single day gameplay. They just always come up. So I just wanted to give y'all my top 10. If you did enjoy this video, feel free to show some love downstairs by liking, commenting, and subscribing to become part of the gang because we have a lot of fun on this channel if you can't already tell. All right, y'all, that's going to be it for me today. Peace and love.